Hello friends of 44F1 and Lewis Hamilton's week in Brazil, how is it? It is a total joy. Few times have I seen Lewis Hamilton as happy as he is during this week in Brazil. He is enjoying a lot these days in his new country, yes, because now Hamilton is also Brazilian, at least that is how the Brazilians consider him after the driver received the title of honorary Brazilian citizen. But what has Hamilton done these past few days in Brazil? He did everything. He became a Brazilian, visited a favela in Rio de Janeiro, and risked his own life climbing a monument on Moro de Providencia. He bet on a race with children, was chased by a crazy woman, met with singers, a surfer, a TV presenter who was his taxi driver, had dinner with a beautiful mulatto girl, visited the British Embassy, met with speakers, and visited Ayrton Senna's farm. Wow man, this is crazy. Now come with me as I tell you this story. Earlier this week Hamilton went to Brasilia, the capital of Brazil, where he was honored and given the title of Honorary Citizen of Brazil. If you want to know more about this, there is a complete video here on the channel. A funny thing happened at this event, a woman came running barefoot behind Hamilton, who got scared. Fortunately it was just a fan wanting to be close to him. Hamilton took the opportunity in Brazil to meet his friend, surfer Gabriel Medina. Medina talked about this meeting with Lewis. This means a lot to me, my great friend and now Brazilian, Lewis Hamilton. In Sao Paulo, the Mercedes driver had dinner with singers S.E.U. Jorge and I.Z.A. I.Z.A. has already been confirmed to sing the Brazilian anthem at Interlagos. One of the most remarkable moments of Hamilton's time in Brazil was his visit to a favela in Rio de Janeiro, Moro de Providencia. There Hamilton played with the children in a trolley and talked with residents of the community. Lewis Words It's exciting to visit Brazil. The race in 2021 was the best of my life. I want to learn more about the culture, the food, the people, and today I met some wonderful kids in Rio. I want them to believe in themselves and never give up on their dreams. Still at Moro de Providencia, Hamilton climbed a very tall sculpture, how insane. Just looking at it makes me afraid. I was about to forget, how did Hamilton get to this favela? By a ride with the TV presenter Luciano Hulk, who was driving a taxi. What? I didn't even understand that one. Hamilton was also interviewed by journalist Reginaldo Lamy. Next week, I will make a video about this interview for you. He also met with some people from the British Embassy, and in the evening he met with the Brazilian speaker Ana K. Melo. Angelo was also present. The Brazilian lawyer and writer, Juliana Souza, talked to Lewis about the project she runs which focuses on rights education for black and peripheral women and youth. Finally, Lewis rides in a golf cart during his visit to Ayrton Senna's farm, located in Tatui, Sao Paulo. Lewis made a point of driving on the racetrack designed by Senna. Now we have the unveiling of Ayrton Senna's bust at Interlagos. A beautiful tribute, no? This is 44F1, enjoy the video, subscribe to the channel, and share with your friends.